The champions kick off weekend number two in the new Barclays Women's Super League season, having done so successfully on weekend number one last Friday, when one goal was just enough to see off Aston Villa. Tonight, it's an all-new fixture at WSL level. Selhurst Park, the venue, the hosts of Crystal Palace, promoted as champions of the championship. Blanchard tried the little flick, it didn't work. And there's space in behind and Canarud straight onto it. These are Chelsea's best opportunities as Palace do indeed get caught out. Aggie Beaver-Jones brilliantly set up by the pacey Canarud. Deadly clinical counter-attack from Chelsea. You've just been waiting for that kind of gap. Finally, Palace are caught upfield. There's no catching Canarud there. Really unselfish as well. Brought in to start tonight. Shortly before half-time, it's 1-0. James with a sneaky one to Ashley Lawrence. That's a good looking ball. This is Lucy Bronze. That's brilliant. Just passed it into the top corner for her first Chelsea goal. There's the breathing room we didn't get against Villa last weekend. All the defenders attracted to the middle. Look at that for a finish. So calm, and so accurate. Neatly done by Beaver Jones. Into Ramirez. Tap in, game over. Lauren James 3 0. It's just so slick. Newly promoted Crystal Palace can't cope. I'm not sure anyone could with football of this quality. Brilliant from Beaver Jones and from Ramirez. Not been on that long. No one's missing that, especially Lauren James. Perisay getting her first action of the season. Beaver Jones into Macario. Vika captain. Gura Wrighton, another fantastic goal from the champions. It's 4 0. And Palace need the full time whistle. But Chelsea, as ever, look in the mood for more. There's still a long way to go here. It's another really good team goal. And the teenage debutant captain with the presence of mind not to go for goal herself, but to see that Wrighton was in a better position. Well done, all. It's a harsh lesson this for Crystal Palace for sure. Macario always on corner duty with these. Ooh, sneaking in round the back, it's in. Natalie Bjorn. Essentially in a 50-50 with Katrina Vai. Well, they're all getting in on the act. She's just poked it in. Rampant second half here, 5-0. Four of them since the restart. Baltimore having a little go at left back where options are more limited actually this season, but the left back coming forward here and she's done well. It's Wrighton threading it through for six. Gura Wrighton's got two of them. Loving this number 10 role. So many ways they can hurt you. Little fingertip from Shea Yanez, but that was all. Maybe slightly unsighted. Six. And we're not done yet. Still plenty of time. Macario. And Miguel got sucked into that challenge. Macario. Uh, found Ramirez and Macario's followed up a pass to be there when it mattered. 
No wonder she's clapping. The newcomers, Crystal Palace, feeling the full force of Chelsea's might here. Macario pouncing with the last kick of a brutal second half showing from the champions. They're only one up at the break. Made it and kept on going here, Macario. The first save's a really good one, but look who's there for the rebound. The WSL newcomers, Crystal Palace, have felt the full force of Chelsea's might tonight. Two wins from two for the new boss, both with clean sheets. But while Aston Villa last Friday night was a bit nervy, this has been emphatic. Only one up at the break through Beaver Jones, but then... The goals started to pour through and they didn't stop. Lucy Bronze with a beauty. A five-star display. And six different scorers. James got one, Wrighton got two. 7-0 at Selhurst Park.